hello guys welcome back to my channel so today we are going to make this very simple easy hippo so what you're gonna need is you're gonna need one kind of yarn the embroidering yarn the safety eyes and also i used a crochet hook uh, which is 4.0 millimeters so that's what you're gonna use and also if you want a small animal you can use a crochet hook which is a little bit smaller so i would recommend from three millimeters until four millimeters okay so let's get started okay so we're going to start with the head and for the head we're going to start with the magic ring first and then we're going to do six single crochet into the magic ring so we're going to do one two three four five Okay, and then I'm going to pull my yarn to close the garb like that okay so after that I'm going to put my marker over here okay and for the second row we're going to increase all the stitches all the way around until the end so we're going to have a total of 12 single crochet okay so we're going to do two single crochet in each stitch so we're going to do two single crochet in the first stitch okay and then also we're going to increase in the second stitch okay so you're going to continue increasing all the way until here at the end okay so after you're done with that uh, in our third row we're going to do single crochet then increase and repeat six times for a total of 18 stitches so we're going to do single crochet and then increase in the next stitch so you're going to do two single crochet in the same stitch and then repeat that again so single crochet and then increase okay so you're going to continue repeating all the way around until the end Okay, so after that, uh, in our fourth row, we're going to do two single crochet, then increase and repeat all the way around for a total of 24 stitches. So we're going to do single crochet, one, single crochet, two, and then increase in the next stitch. Okay, and then you're going to repeat all the way around again. So two single crochet, increase until the end. Okay, so after that, uh, in our fifth row, we're going to do three single crochet, then increase and repeat six times for a total of 30 stitches. So we're going to do single crochet, one, single crochet, two, single crochet, three, then increase in the next stitch. Okay, and then you're going to repeat that again, three single crochet, increase, repeat the same pattern, all the way around until the end okay so after you're done with that uh for the next nine rows which is from row six until row 14 you're going to do single crochet in each row for a total of 30 single crochets so i'll see you when you're done with your 14th row so that we start the 15th row together okay, so after you're done with the 14th row in our 15th row we are going to start decreasing and uh, we're going to start with uh, three single crochet then decrease and repeat six times for a total of 24 stitches so we're going to do one single crochet two then three and then we're going to decrease in the next two stitches so you're going to go in the front loop of the next stitch pull through and the back loop of the next stitch pull through and then pull through all the three loops together okay and then you're going to repeat that again so three single crochet so one two three and then decrease again okay and then you're going to repeat that all the way around until the end for a total of 24 stitches Okay, so after that, uh, in our 16th row, uh, we're going to do 
two single crochet then decrease and repeat all the way around for a total of 18 stitches so we are going to do one two and then decrease in the next two stitches okay and then you're going to repeat the same pattern all the way around until the end okay so after you're done with that uh, in our 17th row which is the last row of the head uh, you're going to do single crochet then decrease and repeat all the way around until the end so when we are done with this row we are going to continue to the body okay so when you're done with this row we're just going to continue to the body we're not going to cut off the yarn okay so we're going to do single crochet and then decrease in the next stitch okay and then you're going to repeat that again single crochet decrease okay and then you're going to repeat that all the way around until the end okay, so after the 17th row now we're going to continue to the body but before we continue to the body make sure you stuff your head fully like i already did as you can see okay so after that uh in our next row uh, which is the first row of the body also or our 18th row we are going to do single crochet all the way around until the end for a total of 12 single crochet so do single crochet all the way around and then i'll show you how to do the 19th row okay so for our 19th row we are going to do single crochet then increase and then single crochet increase all the way around for a total of 18 stitches so we're going to do single crochet then increase in the next stitch so we're going to do two single crochet in the same stitch and then we're going to repeat that again single crochet increase okay so repeat that all the way around until the end Okay, so after you're done with that, uh, in our next row, which is our 20th row, we are going to do single crochet all the way around until the end for a total of 18 single crochet. So do single crochet and then we'll start the 21st row together. Okay, so in our 21st row, we are going to do two single crochet, then increase and repeat that six times for a total of 24 stitches. So we're going to do single crochet one, single crochet two and then increase in the next stitch okay so you're going to repeat that again two single crochet increase all the way around until the end okay so after that uh, in our 22nd row we are going to do single crochet all the way around until the end for a total of 24 stitches so i'll see you when you're done with your 22nd row so that we start the 23rd row together Okay, so after you're done with that, uh, in our 23rd row, we're going to do three single crochet, then increase and repeat six times for a total of 30 stitches. So we're going to do single crochet, one, two, three, and then increase in the next stitch. Okay, and then you're going to repeat that all the way around until the end. Okay, so after you're done with the 20, uh, 23rd row, uh, in our next six rows which is from row 24 until row 29 we're going to do single crochet all the way around in each row for a total of 30 single crochets in each row so i'll see you when you're done with the 29th row so that i show you how to do the 30th row okay so after the 29th row uh this is how it should look like so in the 30th row we are going to start decreasing so we're going to do three single crochet then decrease and repeat all the way around for a total of 24 stitches so we're going to do single crochet one two three and then decrease okay then you're going to repeat that again so three single crochet decrease all the way around until the end so after that uh in our 31st row we're going to do two single crochet 
then decrease and repeat all the way around for a total of 18 stitches so we're going to do single crochet one single crochet two and then decrease okay and then you're going to repeat that again five more times until the end Okay, so when you're done with that, uh, in our 30 second row, we are going to do single crochet, decrease and repeat 6 times for a total of 12 stitches. So you're going to do single crochet and then decrease. Okay, and then repeat the same pattern all the way around. So single crochet, decrease. Okay, so you're going to repeat that all the way around until the end. So when you're done with this row, make sure you stuff the body uh, because uh, the next row is going to be our last row. Okay, so after you stuff your body, this is how it's supposed to look like. So now we're going to do our last row. And in our last row, we're going to decrease all the way around for a total of six single crochet. So you're going to decrease. So decrease okay and then you're going to continue decreasing all the way around okay so decrease all the way around until the end and then when you're done with that I uh, cut off your yarn and then do the finishing and then I'll show you how to do the arms Okay, so for the arms, we're going to start with the magic ring and then six single crochet into the magic ring. So I already did that. So in the second row, we're going to increase each and every stitch for a total of 12 single crochets. So we're going to do two single crochet in the next stitch, first stitch. And then do two single crochet also in the next stitch. Okay, and then you're going to continue doing two single crochet all the way around until the end. Okay, so after you're done with that, uh, in the next row, we're going to do single crochet all the way around until the end for a total of 12 single crochet. So do single crochet and then I'll show you how to do the fourth row. Okay, so in our fourth row, we are going to do first two decrease and then do single crochet in the remaining eight stitches. So we'll have a total of 10 single crochet in this row. So we'll decrease first. So we decrease one time. Okay, and then decrease again the second time. And then we're going to do single crochet in the remaining eight stitches. Okay, so you're going to do single crochet, single crochet, all the way around until the end. Okay, so after you're done with that, uh, in the next nine rows, which is from row five until row 13, you're going to do single crochet all the way around in each row for a total of 10 single crochet in each row. So I'll see you when you're done with the 13th row so that we do the last row, which is the 14th row. Okay, so after you're done uh, with the 13th row, in our 14th row, which is the last row, uh, we're going to decrease all the way around. But before we continue, make sure you stuff your arm and then uh, we do the last row. Okay, so over here we're going to decrease all the way around five times. So we're going to have a total of five single crochets. So you're going to decrease. Okay, and then continue decreasing all the way around. So decrease. Okay, so decrease all the way around until the end. And then when you get to the end, cut the yarn long enough for sewing. 
okay and then i'll show you how to do the legs so for the leg we are going to start with a chain five so we're going to do one two three four and five and then starting from the second hook from the chain we're going to do single crochet in the next three stitches so uh, you're going to start in the second chain so we're going to do single crochet and then also do single crochet in the next chain and single crochet in the last chain Okay, and then in the last chain we are going to do three single crochet in the same chain so we're going to do single crochet one single crochet two and then another single crochet in the same chain okay I'm just going to pull to close the gap okay and then we're going to turn to the other side and also in the other side we're going to do single crochet in the next three stitches so I'm going to go in the next chain and do single crochet one and then single crochet in the next chain and single crochet in the third chain okay and then in the last chain we're going to do three single crochet in the same chain so we're going to do single crochet one single crochet two and single crochet three okay so after you're done with that uh, we have a total of 12 stitches so we're going to start in the second round and in our second round we're going to do first single crochet in the next three stitches so we're going to do single crochet one and then again single crochet in the next stitch and single crochet in the third stitch okay and then after that uh, we're going to increase three times so you're going to do to increase in the next stitch and then increase also in the next stitch and increase in the next stitch okay and then after that uh, we're going to do single crochet in the next three stitches so we're going to do single crochet single crochet two and single crochet three okay and then we're going to increase in each of the remaining three stitches so you're going to increase and then increase also in the next stitch and increase in the last stitch okay so now we have a total of 18 stitches so after you're done with that, uh, in the next row, we're going to do single crochet all the way around until the end for a total of 18 stitches. So you're going to do single crochet, single crochet, okay, and repeat all the way around until the end. Okay, so after you're done with that, uh, in the next row, which is our fourth row, we are going to do three single crochet, then decrease and repeat three times. And then uh, we'll do three single crochet in the remaining stitches okay so we're going to do single crochet one single crochet two single crochet three and then decrease one time okay so repeat that two more times so you're going to do three single crochet decrease and then three single crochet and decrease again okay so after you're done with that you have three stitches left here at the end so you're going to do single crochet in each stitch so you're going to do single crochet single crochet and single crochet okay 
So now we'll have a total of 15 stitches in that row. Okay, so now in our next row, we are going to do two single crochet, then decrease and do three times. Okay, so we're going to do single crochet one, single crochet two, and then decrease. Okay, so repeat that again two more times. Okay, so after that, in the remaining three stitches, do single crochet until the end. So we're going to do single crochet, single crochet, and single crochet. Okay, so we have a total of 12 stitches now in that row. Okay, so after you're done with that, in the next eight rows, which is from row six until row 13, you're going to do single crochet in every row. Uh, for a total of 12 stitches in each row. So I'll see you when you're done in the 13th row so that we do the last row which is the 14th row. Okay so after you're done with the 13th row in our last row which is our 14th row we are going to decrease all the way around for a total of 6 stitches. Okay so we're going to go so we're going to decrease Okay, and then repeat again so decrease okay and also decrease all the way around until the end and also before you finish up make sure you stuff your leg completely and then I'll show you how to make the uh, snout or the nose okay so for the nose you're going to start with the chain 7 so I already did that uh, and we're going to start doing single crochet in the second chain from the hook so you're going to just do single crochet and then single crochet single crochet okay so you're going to continue doing single crochet all the way around until here the end okay so after you get to the end you're going to continue doing single crochet on the other side so you're going to turn and continue doing single crochet and then single crochet so all the way around until the end so we have a total of 12 single crochet uh, in total Okay, so after you're done with that, uh, in our next row, which is our second row, we're going to increase all the way around in each stitch for a total of 24 stitches. So you're going to do two single crochet, the next stitch, and then repeat two single crochet. Okay, so increase all the way around until the end. Okay, so after that, uh, in our third row, we are going to do single crochet, then increase and repeat all the way around for a total of 36 stitches. So we're going to do single crochet, then increase in the next stitch. Okay, and then repeat that again, single crochet, increase. Okay, so repeat that all the way around until the end. Okay, so after you're done with that, uh, in the next four rows, which is from four, uh, row four until row seven, you're going to do single crochet all the way around in each row for a total of 36 stitches. So I'll see you when you're done with the seventh row so that we start the eighth row together. So after the seventh row, in our eighth row, we are going to do single crochet, then decrease and repeat all the way around for a total of 24 stitches. So we're going to do single crochet and then decrease and then repeat that again single crochet and then decrease okay so repeat that all the way around until the end okay so after that uh, in our ninth row we are going to do single crochet all the way around until the end for a total of 24 stitches so I'll see when you're done with the ninth row so that we do the last row which is the tenth row okay so in our tenth row which is our last row we are going to do single crochet then decrease and repeat all the way around for a total of 18 stitches so we're going to do single crochet 
and then decrease and then repeat that single crochet decrease okay so repeat that all the way around until the end so when you're done at the end cut the yarn long enough for uh, sewing and then after that i'll show you how to make the ears so for the ears we're going to start with uh, the magic ring okay and then we'll do five single crochets into the magic ring so we'll do one two three four and five okay and then we're going to close the gap okay so after that uh, in our second row which is also our last row we are going to start with a chain one so you're going to do chain one and then in the next stitch we're going to do single crochet okay and then after that in the next stitch we're going to do half double crochet so you're going to yarn over go in the next stitch pull through and then pull through all the three stitches Okay, and then in the next stitch we're going to do two half double crochet okay so we're going to do one double crochet and then in the same stitch do another half double crochet okay and then in the next one in the next stitch we're going to do half double crochet Okay, and then in the last stitch we're going to do single crochet okay and then after that you're just going to cut off your yarn and leave it long enough for sewing okay so after that uh, make the next tier and then I'll show you how to join all the other parts together okay guys so as you can see I already finished attaching the parts together so for the eyes, I attached it between the 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, between the 6th and the 7th row, uh, the two eyes. And for the ears, you attach it between 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, from the 5th until the 7th row on the side and also on the other ear. And for the mouth, you just position it between the ears over here, as you can see. And also for the arms, uh, you have to make sure they are in line with the ears together. The legs too so make sure they are on one line also make sure you use the pins before you sew them completely so you just attach them on the side and on the other side and I also made I made a chain for the tail just a little uh, a, a little chain here okay so you can do that and also for the bow tie here I also made a chain long enough and then I tied it okay so that's it and then i embroidered the nose uh, one two three so count uh three rows and then embroider between the three rows and on this other side too and that's it guys so i hope you enjoyed this very simple pattern if you haven't subscribed to my channel please subscribe and also check out my other videos so i make uh one video every week so thank you bye